What do you call a computer small enough to fit in the palm of your hand? I call these machines micro desktops, and the best example is Intel's line of compute sticks. These look like slightly oversized USB keys, but inside is a full Windows powered desktop. There's an HDMI port at one end, so you just plug it into any TV or monitor, add a keyboard and mouse, and you've got a working computer. The original compute sticks ran Intel Atom processors and cost around $150. They were fine for basic web surfing, uh, but nobody really wants to use an Atom powered PC all day long. This upgraded model looks and feels very similar, but cranks the CPU up to a Core M3, which is Intel's upscale line of processors for super thin, super light laptops and desktops, kind of like the 12 uh, inch Apple MacBook. It plays HD video, does photo editing, and feels much more like an everyday desktop. But that also means it's more expensive, currently $389. That's a big jump from the earlier compute sticks, but still hundreds less than most other Core MPCs. The last compute stick we looked at had two USB ports built into it. This one drops that number back to one, but adds two more to the kind of hefty power brick, so at least you can plug in USB receivers for a keyboard and the mouse if you don't want to use Bluetooth. The biggest advantage of a stick PC has more to do, I think, with security than price or performance. You can keep all your files safely on it, take them to a meeting or on a trip, and then when you're done, just stick the entire thing in your pocket and walk away.